Sprinting away from the 1,000 meter marker. Fancy Philly got squeezed and jumped awkwardly as towards the inside running rail. Two wooers quick. The white cap of Little Winter's going out to match them. Fair Antonio's right there. Juanita's got the blue cap. Candy Galore's back fifth, only three lengths off the leader. Then comes Yasin Taliki. Fancy Philly Red Sleeves and Cap is near the rail. Majestic Mary's on the outside. Then comes Spiffy, Rosie Bubbles, and Northern Storm. Compact field as they turn for home, 500 meters to go. Little Winter with the white cap and Fair Antonia. Candy Galore comes off now with the red cap. On the outside, Yas Fancy Philly to Woos on the inside. Further back in the run is Juanita. Coming to the last 250, Candy Galore, Fair Antonia, Fancy Philly on the outside, and then Yars. Candy Galore still leads it though. Fancy Philly and Fair Antonia over the last 100, but Candy Galore's going on, and Candy Galore will win. Second will go to Fancy Philly, third, Fair Antonia, two woo, ran fourth. Number two, Candy Galore, the Nordic Flyer, Gareth Finzale. They win well. It's now won two out of three. The one was a barrier trial and it pulled off and came off well towards the outside. Wins by a length and a quarter. Fancy Philly. I don't know if my producer can just go back to the start after we speak about the head on. I just want to watch Fancy Philly come out of those gates. And then Fair Antonia, two woo runs, fourth in Spiffy. Toliki, Majestic Mary, and Rosie Bubbles. Toad favourite, the winner at 3.30. Looking at the head-on, and Candy Galore comes good here. And this is the Nurduk Flyer, and this is Warren Kennedy, and owned by Volgobor Drift, and they win it well. So we'll go back to that 1,000-metre gate, and we'll just look at Fancy Philly come out of those gates. It's got the red sleeves and cap, and we'll take a look at that. So look at gate number three. Let's just see when they open those gates. It's head is up, slight fly jump, and then Majestic Mary appears just to lean onto it. And then once again, a fly jump. So it would never have beaten the winner, I don't say. It wouldn't have beaten the winner. Could have got a little bit closer. That's all for the time being. Thank you very much, Denver. Craig Peters signing off. Well, another impressive win by Candy Galore, Warren Kennedy, another winner for him, and Gareth, young Gareth Fanzel is doing exceptionally well. Well done, Gareth. Mr. Left, thank you very much. Smart filly. She is, and it's such a gratifying win. You know, it's so rewarding. Um, you know, Mrs. Slack uh, gave me a chance last year at the National Two Yard Sale. I'm so delighted um, to, to be able to re, uh, you know, give her repay something. Her, yeah. yeah, repay her. Thank you. Yeah, absolutely. Her faith was well founded and well done. Uh, you placed this filly well. She had three months off and uh, looked competitive, but uh, she, she beat them comfortably. She's a progressive filly, as yeah. you say. Um, and you know, Kevin and the, Warren, they spotted her also. Um, you know, she didn't be the strongest field last time out, um, but she could only win. And she's she's very progressive. Um, she won't stop you. Yeah. Have a lot of fun. Again, big well done to the breeders, um, Gail Page, Mertz Fintin and Volkerbos, all involved. Um, it's just a pleasure trading this filly and to Johar Malherb, uh, who I, I keep in touch with regarding, and to Warren as well. You know, he's putting in a lot of work back home, and it's, it's a great asset to have him in the yard as a part of it. Well done. Just. Well done, Warren. You did say it's smart, smart sort, you know, and uh, won a good race. Quickened when you wanted it to. Yeah, Mr. Left, smart filly, you know, but I heard Gareth applauding me, but he must get the credit for this filly. You know, she has got a, a little touch about her. She can be a bit silly when she wants to, but he's brought her along the right way. She's settling down as she's getting mature, so a really great job. She could have gone either way. Yeah. But, um, yeah, all the ability in the world was left. I mean, I, I had in the box seat. I was happy where I was. Yeah. Asked her to quicken. It was basically race over for me. She was, she, her work was so good, it was basically a penalty kick here, but she, she still got to do it. She still, yeah. last time she missed the break a bit. Today, much more professional. She's grown up a bit. So, yeah, looking forward to a lot more from her. How many winners you have? Today? Just yeah. two, just, just two, two today. Slow day. Yeah, slow, slow day, yeah. Day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but um, just again, thanks to Jessica and to Steve, you know, they, they, they gave Gareth the, the opportunity to this filly and he's, he's producing it, which is very nice, you know, and um, yeah, well done to Gareth again. Well done. Thanks very much. Yeah, Warren Kennedy, top rider. Well done. Uh,
to Mary. Well done to her whole team at uh, Maritzfontein and Vogelbostrof. This is a, a smart little girl. She, she quickened up well and uh, on pedigree she's got to go a bit further. So a lot to look forward to and uh, that concludes our meeting. No racing Friday, but we're back on Sunday. I think we're up at the big Scottsville.